Hi, my name is Sabrina Watson and I'm in the marketing department here at Alliance Benefit Group Rocky Mountain. Today I will be interviewing Lawrence Salmon. Larry is the president of ABG Consultants and he is also the author of our recent blog post, Financial Wellness, A Fad or Indispensable. Larry, how are you doing? I'm doing great, thank you. Awesome, thank you for joining me here today. Um, to get things started, why don't you tell us all a little bit about your experience in the retirement space? Sure. I've been in the retirement industry nearly 20 years now, um, part of that time on the record keeping side and, and part of that time on the investment advice side. And during that time I've seen quite a few changes in the retirement industry. And one of those changes that you saw is financial wellness, which you wrote about yes. in your blog post. Uh, why don't you tell us a little bit about what financial wellness is? Sure. Um, we hear a lot about uh, uh, health wellness, health and wellness, but financial wellness is similar in that health, if you're not healthy, then you're going to be a drag on your employer's bottom line in that you might be taking too many days off or being overly consumed about your health. But financial wellness is the same thing. If your financial house is not in order, you're going to be spending a lot of time trying to fix those things. Your employees will be spending their time at work making phone calls and, and, and trying to fix their life. So, so we feel that like financial wellness is just as important as their health and wellness. Um, and we saw your blog post is actually one of our top viewed web pages right now. You kind of talked about it a little bit, but why do you think that people are so interested in learning about financial wellness? I, again, it's, I think it's a matter of what is going to be most effective for the employer and helping them have um, healthy employees, uh, both from a physical standpoint as well as a uh, financial standpoint. Okay. Uh, so one of the challenges that you kind of wrote about in your blog post is that with all of these tools that are being provided to plan participants, they're not actually using them. What advice would you give to financial advisors and plan sponsors who are trying to increase their adoption rate? Great question. So that I think the, the key to getting better adoption into financial wellness is devising a plan to get information out to the employees of the companies that you're working with. Whether you're a plan sponsor or owner of the company or whether you're an advisor, you can be proactive in getting that information out to the employee base and they will uh, adopt, uh, we find that, that they'll adopt a lot, a lot quicker if that happens and if it's proactive from the employer. Um, and does it make a real difference to actually adopt these financial wellness tools? Like, have they seen yes. changes? Yes, yeah. they have. They definitely have. And I can talk about myself in my own experience where I have used all the tools that we provide and have seen a difference in my own life because now I know where my gaps are. I know what things I need to be concerned about. I understand how Social Security plays a role in my retirement. I understand where my debt is and where and what I can do to to uh, fix that. Um, and, and so, yeah, I, I think that these tools are very important if they're adopted. Okay. And in your blog post, you mentioned that financial finesse is a financial wellness tool offered by Alliance Benefit Group Rocky Mountain. Uh, could you describe some of the other financial wellness tools offered? Sure. So a couple other tools that we have is um, we have a, um, an account aggregator that we use which helps aggregate the, uh, the, all the accounts that a person might have, whether they be uh, credit cards or bank accounts or it could be your mortgage loan, uh, car loans and other things like that. You can aggregate those into one website for yourself that, that now you can manage your finances in one place. Um, another one is a social security analyzer that can be used to, to let you know how to maximize your benefit once you are retired. Okay, cool. Well, thank you so much for your time, Larry. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below or you can reach out to your client service manager. Thank you so much for your time and have a great day.